into the video, I want to tell you guys about my new Patreon that I just started, where you can donate money at any amount to help save the channel, and to also help build the quality of my videos for you, loyal fans. I will leave a link in the bio down below, in the description down below for more info. Click on the link and donate at any amount that you want that will help me and you build a better channel, and also save the channel at that being as well. Now, enjoy the video you guys, peace out. Notification swap, turn on notifications on because this is Reaction Action Nation with the Rudder Devon segment. And today we are here to do the 10 hardest mind tricks. 90% will fail. Let's see if I fail and let's do this. This shouldn't be that hard, but let's hope. Let's hope we can do this. All right. Do me a favor, hit that like button down below. Hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that bell for more notifications from me. It'll come to you. Also, let me know what you want me to react to next. And I got you, fam. Hashtag REM. Let's get right into this reaction video, you guys. Let's go. Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here and today we're going to be looking at the 10 hardest mind tricks ever. So these mind tricks are basically made to make you look stupid or to confuse you and sometimes even guess what you're thinking. Okay. And you guys can trick all of your friends with these. So definitely watch to the end of this video because there's some things on here which are the most insane thing I've ever seen. And don't forget, drop a like if you enjoy. Let's aim for 6,000 likes on this video because it really does help me out. So coming in at number 10, know, we have problem. number trick. So for this one, I need you to do something, but it's really easy and it's only four steps. Okay. So first work out 1 plus 1 which is 2, mm -hmm. then 2 plus 2 which is 4, then 8 plus 8 which is 16, and now name a vegetable. So I'll give you guys a second to name your vegetable. Um, and corn. I'm going to guess that you guys thought of carrot. I know guys, this one is so insane and if you didn't think of carrot then you're very unusual because 90% of people do. And scientists have been trying to work out why they think it has something to do with carrot being a six letter word. Because the last number was 16 and that ends in a six. Or maybe it's just because carrots are the most obvious vegetable. But who knows? And this trick totally got me and blew my mind when I first heard it. So definitely leave a comment saying which vegetable you thought of. So next up we have triangle. So I need you guys to do something for this one too. All okay. you need to do is read out the text inside this triangle. So I'm going to give you a second to do that. Oh, this is a Paris in the, the spring. There's an extra that. And I'm sure you guys read Paris in the spring, right? Well, go ahead and read it again. Did it still say that? Well, then nope. wake up. Because if you look closely, it says Paris in the, the spring. And I bet yep. you guys didn't even notice the second the. Because I didn't, even after I read each word like four different times. Mm -hmm. And this was actually made by a professor of cognition psychology, which is basically about how our knowledge can make us more dumb. So for example, we know it should be Paris in the spring, so we just automatically correct it in our minds, but actually that makes us less observant. And only around 4% of people get this first time, so if you did get this, then you're a really observant person. So well done. <laughs> So next up we have insane instructions. So you guys do have to do quite a few instructions for this one, but trust me, it's so worth it. Because this one is probably one of the craziest ones on this entire list. So pick a number between two and eight. I'm gonna choose six, then multiply it by nine, so that's 54. And then you should have two digits, so add them together. So five plus four, making nine. Then subtract five, so that's gonna leave us with four. And then pick a letter to go with your number. So I'm gonna choose D. And then think of a country that starts with that letter. So I'm gonna say Denmark. And then think of an animal starting with the letter of the country, so an animal starting with K, so I'm gonna say kangaroo. Mm -hmm. And now, think of a colour starting with the last letter of the animal, so that's O, I'm gonna go with orange. And if you guys chose the same thing as me, or something different, then I bet you guys got the answer of an orange kangaroo in Denmark. Ah, I had to put this one on the list how accurate and specific this is. Like, I have no idea how this works, or how insane you have to be to come up with something like this. And if this didn't work for you, then that's really weird, because only 2% of people aren't affected by this. So try this on a friend or family member, and you can blow their mind because my mind is definitely blown right now so next up we have rude or not so I'm sure you guys have seen this already on Twitter or Facebook before and this one is so old but it gets me every single time and I guess you could say this is kind of like a dirty minded test so when you look at this photo you probably read I have a big dick but really it says I have a dig big but because mm -hmm. we all sort of have a dirty mind and our minds yeah. notice shocking and offensive stuff a lot more than normal stuff so we instantly think it says something rude and because our minds automatically want to make sense of things 
kind of like Paris in the, the spring from before, then it just automatically works it out. But right. that's not the only mind trick in this photo, because underneath that, it says you read that wrong. But under that, it says you read that wrong too, because it says above it, you that read wrong. So again, yeah, it read wrong. you. And even that awkward underneath when you that read wrong, that because wrong you probably too. read that awkward moment when you say something wrong, but really, the word moment is left out. I moment. mean, shit, they just tricked us like four times in a row. Right, right. thing about this one, which isn't a trick, is the last line that says, this is awkward. And yeah, guys, let me know if you have a dirty mind, or if you just got tricked. And if you didn't get tricked by this, then well done, because 96% of people do. So next up, we have how many Fs. So this one is so simple, and it makes you feel really dumb if you don't get it. So all you have to do here is answer how many Fs are in this sentence, which says, finished files are a result of scientific study combined with the experience of years. So most people count two Fs because of the two words here, or maybe three because they see the F in scientific, but some people don't see that F because the word gets cut off here. But there's actually six Fs because of the three ofs which are in the sentence. And the reason most people don't get this really obvious one is because they don't notice the Fs in of. Because it's such a ah, well, well, I freaking fell that one again! Oh, I feel kind of bad for of. Yeah. Pour it down. Pour it down. Pour it down. But yeah, this one has a cool mind trick, and if you didn't get caught out by this one, then well done, but don't get too happy, because only around 70% of people get caught out by this, so even though you're better than most people, it's not as hard as some of the ones before. So coming up next, we have what number comes next. So this one is a really cool number mind trick, and all you have to do is read out these numbers. So that's 6, 11, 17, and 28. And then, say what number should come next. So I'm gonna give you a second to say your number. Uh, and I bet most of you got 45. They did it too fast. The number before always adds up to the next number in the sequence. For example, 6 plus 11 makes 17, and then 17 plus 11 makes 28. So it's like your mind subconsciously adds up the numbers. So this one basically oh. shows how quickly your mind can think without you even making it. So unlike all the others, this one kind of makes oh my, you feel smart and confused. And this number sequence can go on forever, as you can see here. But most people don't say it right after 45, so I just did it up to that point. And around 80% of people say 45. And almost everyone does this subconsciously. So who knows, maybe we're all secretly great at math. And I say secretly because I know I'm not good in real life. So coming up next, we have number predicting. So this is another number trick. And this one isn't so much of a mind trick, but more of a visual trick. But you can still fool a ton of people with this. So all you need to do is pick any number and then follow the line to the number on the opposite side. And then take your two numbers and subtract the small one from the big one. And I bet the answer you get is six. So I'm going to choose eight and then that goes to two. So eight minus two is six. But there's a catch. Because this has been made so smartly, it means that any combination you choose, you'll always get six. For example, if I take 12 and that goes to six, Six, then 12 minus 6 is 6. So yeah, the answer is guaranteed to be 6 every time, but that doesn't stop you from fooling a ton of people with this. And because all you need for this trick is a circle with 12 numbers in it, you can use any clock. And the guy who worked out the clocks do this must have been really smart, because I had no idea so the clocks did this before. So whatever you backwards to, it's going to be 6. start commenting saying you didn't get 6, well, you can't, because that's a lie. So don't even try that shit. So next up, we have mm. memorize names. So this is a memory um, test, ah, which 90% of people suck get with names. So it I'm shows 6 people here and their names. Ben, Mike, so Brian, I'm going to give you a second. I'm gonna suck at and this. Now here's the test. Can you remember the names of these three people? And no going ben. back to check, that's cheating. So it Wait, turns ben. out that only 4% of people can actually get this right. And the correct answer is Ryan, Ted, and Bill. And that's because these are the least memorable ones on here, because the other ones stand out in some way. For example, the red ones are an eye-catching colour, and Ben, the other yellow one, is to the left. So yeah, so yeah, it just goes to show that boring people don't stand out. I'm freaking I'm an idiot. Yep. Yeah. But yeah, guys, don't feel too bad for Ryan, Ted, and Bill because it made a lot of people seem really dumb, including me, because I didn't get this when I first tried it, but comment if you did. So next up we have Duck and alone. Rabbit. So this is a really cool visual mind trick, and you're definitely gonna get into a lot of arguments if you show this to your family and friends, and I'll explain why right now. So when you look at this image from this way, then you probably see a duck, right? And there you have it, it was a duck. Nah, I'm just kidding guys, of course there's more, because if you look at it this way, you'll probably see a rabbit, because the eye is the same on each side, but the duck's yeah. the rabbit is, depending on what side you look at. And I know I told you that both animals are in the image, but some people don't know, and they only look at it from one way. And yeah, this image can cause a ton of arguments, and it has done for over 100 years, because it was made in 1899 by an American psychologist called Joseph Jastrow, and basically it was to test people's mental ability. So let me know if you guys saw both animals, or just one, even though I probably already did ruin it for you by telling you so soon. Sorry. And coming up last on this list, we have black dots. So this is a really crazy optical illusion, and it really messes with your eyes. Like, you know when you wake up and everything's blurry? It's basically yeah. like that. And it's so simple. Wrong. All you have to do is count the black dots. So, how many can you guys count?
Well, you should have got 35. And there's actually no way to do this with your eyes. Because over time, when you look at the white dot, all of the other dots will go white except the one you're looking at. So yeah, this is a crazy illusion. And the only way to get the answer is to either guess or multiply 7 by 5. And this one really made my eyes hurt because I tried to do this by counting. And the reason it messes with They're your doing eyes it is too fast. the surrounding white squares and the great grid create a contrast and then your eyes think the contrast should be in the dots as well. So it's basically a mind trick which also tricks your eyes. And this is based off another more simple illusion that's been around for over a hundred years. And the answer to that one is 35 too. So yeah, this has been so cool to check out all these mind tricks. And that just about wraps up this video. Check I'm out tricked. the poll in the top right corner and you guys can vote for the coolest mind trick. For me it's the carrot one just because that blew my mind. I mean it seriously feels like whoever made that was literally inside of my head. Or maybe I'm just going insane. I need a genius as I might And head. guys, just before I completely end off in this video, I just want to quickly say follow me on Twitter at CharlieTop10s. It'll be on screen oh, yeah, right now. And yes guys, I do reply to DMs, messages and all of that stuff and I also do follow you guys back. And you guys have been sending me a ton of really nice messages and even fan art and stuff which is so crazy and I will be shouting you guys out soon. Right. So yeah guys, follow my Twitter ASAP at CharlieTop10s. Well as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Check out some more videos on screen now. Leave a like if you enjoyed and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. All right, you guys, we failed, or well, I failed again. I'm gonna stop doing these tests, man. I'm just making myself look bad on camera. Oh, God. Okay, uh, if you like this video and this test, then go check it out. But if you like my reaction, then do me a favor, hit the like button down below, hit the subscribe button, also hit the bell for more notifications from me. It'll come to you. Also, let me know what you want me to react to next, and I got you, fam. Hashtag R-A-N. I will see you guys in the next reaction video. Till then, I say peace.